are in the uh, North Streets. Well, let's start looking around, I guess. What's going on, Box Bros? It's Rage Box here, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Kotar. Alrighty, Karth, well, it's not about time to go to that party yet. Uh, so, let's go down the street here and check this area out. Yes, hello, cities, hello. Yes, hardly any aliens. Yes, yes, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yes, oh, hello, my good man. How are you? That new mercenary working for Davik. I heard he's a Mandalorian. Huh? I wonder if he fought in the Mandalore Wars. Ma Mandalore Wars? Mandalorian? Oh, boy. I don't know how I feel about that Mandalorian's cart. They're, uh, they're a ruthless bunch. What is this planet coming to, huh? <gasps> what? Shlami's just walking around the upper city. Shouldn't you go to Lars says you belong, Shlami? Well, this is rich. What? Yeah, like he said. These streets are for upper city citizens. <laughs> you better get out of the way if you know what's good for you. What the? Are these a bunch of drunk vagrants just trying to mess with us right now? What's going on? Maybe we can try to end this peacefully. Hey guys, we can all be friends here. Let, oh, I don't really want to buy him a drink, but screw it, I guess. C come on. A drink? Hey, hey, for a slummy, you ain't so bad. Come on, boys, this slummy's buying the next round. <laughs> Oh god, no way, forget it. No more drinks. We're late enough as it is. Uh, uh, yeah. I guess you're right. Maybe next time, Slummy. <laughs> Come on, fellas, let's go. You frickin' drunks. I got light side points again, dude. <laughs> I'm gonna be a goddamn paragon by the time we're done here on Terrace. Those are easy ass light side points, though, boys. I, I can't pass it up. See you later, you drunk fucking shlummies. <laughs> we're shlummies, Karth. Let's get it. What's going on over here? A droid shop? Okay, this could be interesting, Karth. We got a droid shop. Hello? Oh, there's only one person in here. I'm all alone. There's no one here beside me. My problems have all gone. Stop singing! How you doing, lady? A customer? Come in, come in. Janice now at your service. Welcome to my droid and droid supply shop. Always good to see a new face. Customers are hard to come by. A lot of terrorist citizens won't even come in here. They refuse to shop at a store owned by a Twi'lek. Oh, that's terrible. Terrible. What a bunch of species this, am I right? What do they have against Twi'leks? They don't like aliens much here in Upper Terrace. They tolerate us Twi'leks, but they'd rather see us as dancers in the cantina than successful business owners. Oh, jeez. You'd think people would be a little more tolerant of others in this day and age. I guess stupidity and ignorance will never go out of style. You'll see a few aliens around, but most of the non-humans stick to the lower city. I've learned not to dwell on it, though. I try to stay focused on running my store. My selection is a bit limited right now. The Sith confiscated all my assault droids, but I've got a utility droid you might find interesting. Oh shit, confiscated all the assault droids, damn. Yeah, that might have been good to have. But a utility droid, huh? What do they do? What don't they do? They're great at making vehicle repairs for starters, pretty handy to have in a fight, small but tough with a surprising amount of firepower, and there's no better code breaker or security system slicer around. Not that I condone you doing anything illegal, of course. Uh-huh, yeah, that's, I never condone you doing anything illegal, right, right, when well, we just might have to do some illegal things on this planet to get out of here. Well, let me see your droids then, I'm kinda interested, but first, I wanna ask you some questions. I don't know if I can help you with your questions. I don't get out much. I prefer spending time with my droids to mingling with the terror citizens. But I'll try to help you out. Okay, at least she's trying to help us out. Do you know anything about the escape pods that crashed here on Terrace? People are saying a few of the pods crashed down in the Undercity. I blame it on human error. A droid wouldn't lose control of the ship like that. Anything else? Well, that's it. They're in, they're in the Undercity. I mean, I guess that's all we need to know, and that's probably all we're ever going to know about them. So we, we just got to get to the Undercity. And the only way to do that is to get to the Lower City first. And, oh god, I'm not looking forward to going down there. So how do you feel about the Sith? I don't think much of them since they came and seized most of my droids. I guess they were afraid of someone using my droids against them. Or maybe they wanted to use my droids for themselves. There's no such thing as a bad droid. But sometimes they fall in with bad owners. Mm, that's true. They might be using her droids against people. So let me see your droids. I've only got two droids left. A rebuilt T3H80 unit for 50 credits, and a top-of-the-line T3M4 model with all the options. But he's not for sale. He's not for sale? That sounds like a good one. 
Okay then, uh, I guess I'll take the T3 H8. 50 credits isn't a bad deal. You know a bargain when you see one. This little guy's as reliable as used droids get. I did the reconditioning on him myself. Don't worry. He'll follow you everywhere. Cool, I, I guess that'll be it. Thanks, Janice Nail. Maybe I'll see you around later. Don't forget my store motto. If you need droid parts, Janice Nail is your gal. Thank you very much, I appreciate it. So, wait, which one is he? This guy? Oh! Holy shit! Is he supposed to make that buzzing noise? Is, is that is that normal? Karth, is that normal? Yes. Okay, if you say so. You got it. All right then, Mr. New Droid, uh, come this way, follow me. Um, excuse me, Mr. New Human, uh, Master Sir Beep, uh, Beep Uh, the name is Valen Kor, for your information, little droid, and, uh, w what is it, you all right? Oh, God, I don't know how to say it, but, oh, oh, God, I, my ass, it hurts. Oh, it hurts. Oh, God. God, it hurts! What, what the hell you mean, your ass? What, what does that even mean? What, what's wrong with you? It feels like there's something stuck in my back exhaust port. Oh, oh, Jesus. Oh, robot Jesus, help me. All right, well, I paid 50 bucks for your ass, so you, better, you gotta just deal with it, okay? Uh, listen, I'm an expert at repair, so I'll take a look at you when we get back to the apartment, all right? Oh, oh, God, I, I, I can't. I can't go on. I'm too, too weak. Oh. Too fucking weak! Man, Karth, I don't know what the hell's wrong with this droid, but, uh, all right, let's, let's go. Oh, God. Oh, it slipped deeper into my robot asshole. Oh, Jesus, this is it. Oh! What the? Now more powerful than ever. What? What the hell are you talking about, Karth? How the hell is he more powerful now? That doesn't make any sense. What the hell? Oh my God! I gotta get my money back for this goddamn thing. You, you wait out here, Karth. I'll be right back. Welcome back to my shop. Hey, where's that little T three A J unit I sold you? Uh, it, it blew up. Like literally, Karth. Didn't I tell you to wait outside? It literally blew up. I want my money back. It blew up? Huh. I thought I'd taken care of that little cross-wiring problem. Well, don't worry. I run an honest business here. I don't have to give you a refund, but I don't lose a customer. Here, have your 50 credits back. No hard feelings, right? What's this don't have to give you a refund crap? What kind of policy is that? Your damn droid blew up. But yeah, no hard feelings. Glad to hear it. I can't afford to make my customers unhappy. Business is tough enough as it is. So anything else you need? No, I guess that's it. Maybe I'll see you around later. Don't forget my store motto. If you need droid parts, Janice Nail is your gal. Janice Nail is your gal. Yeah, sure. Building droids that blow up in your frickin' asshole. I guess we're just gonna leave his ass here. Oh well, poor droid. Uh, what else is going on around here? Hello. The evil walks among us. What? The enemy is here. We must act now before we are overrun with the vermin invaders. Wait a second. What? Hello? A plague spreads through our streets. Plague? We cannot sit idly by while this pox infects our society. Gorton Kolu? What is this, like a doomsayer? Friends and fellow humans, I bring you a warning. A warning of a great plague spreading across our planet. Please. Listen to me. My name is Gorton Kolu. Will you join my cause? Uh, we must band together if we are to stop the spread of vermin and scum throughout Taris. Uh, sounds like a noble cause. I mean, vermin and scum, I definitely uh, don't want them walking around. Are you referring to the Sith, though? Or what are you talking about? I am speaking of the hideous looking aliens Wh who walk the world of Taris. What? The Wookiees and Ithorians and Rodians and Bith, all of them. Huh? Listen, friend, for these are dark times. That is why I, Gorton Kolu, have formed the Anti-Alien League. What? The time has come for action. We cannot sit idly by while aliens blight our glorious planet. 
What the? Oh my god, the AAL, <laughs> the Anti-Alien League. Oh my goodness. Well, while I don't agree with his message, it is his right to say it. I am a proprietor of freedom of speech. It's a terrible thing, though. Terrible thing. It's, it's not right, but I'll just leave you to your preaching, buddy. You, you just uh, keep on keeping on, you, you crazy old kook. Remain true to the cause, friend. <laughs> Enlightened humans such as yourself are few and far between. But we shall triumph when the day of reckoning comes. No, no. <laughs> Karth, wait. <laughs> Listen to me, people. That is a terrible oh scourge God. sweeping. Don't get me wrong, guys. Definitely don't agree with what he said, but I believe in freedom of speech, so... I don't I don't know if there's a constitutional terrorist. I don't think there is, but he still has the right to say it, even if he's an idiot. Unless it's a call to action, which it, it kind of might have been. Oh, boy. Well, whatever. There's not much we could do about it right now. But anyway. Uh, Sith Guard. This elevator is off limits. Oh. Only Sith patrols and those with proper authorization are allowed into the lower city. It's obvious from the way you're dressed that you're not one of the Sith patrols. So unless you have the authorization papers, you must move along. Oh, shit. So this is the elevator to get into the lower city. Well, where can I get the authorization papers? If you were supposed to have them, you'd know where to get them. Now quit wasting my time and move along. Oh, God. I'll be going. Move along, then. We're gonna need some kind of disguise if we want to get past this guy. You'll need, wait, uniforms for both Karth and yourself to get into the lower city? Oh, shit. Uniforms for Karth and my... Wait. Wait a minute. Set. Most of us won't even be going back to the base to lock up our uniforms. Oh, sh Karth, we gotta get to that party. And it's just about time, too. Come on. Well, here it is. This is the this is the place. Uh, are you are you ready, Karth? You got you got your best clothes on. Oh wait, Karth's already all dressed up fancy. When the hell did that happen? There we go. Oh, we what? can't be just holding guns and weapons at a party, Karth. Come on now. All right, all right. Uh, um, I do believe it's this way, Karth. Follow me. Hey, kid, what's up? Is you one of the Sith? What? Uh, My daddy says the Sith are nothing but bullies. You don't look like a bully. I'm not a bully. I'm not with the, those damn Sith. Uh-oh. It's locked, Karth. <laughs> we might have to go on another spree, Karth. But first, let's get to that party. You're doing good work, Mr. Droid. Now, that's a good utility droid. Here it is. Oh, shit. It's bumping. It's bumping, Karth. All right. Act natural, Karth. Don't say anything. Just let me do the talking. All right, Karth? You got it. All right. Ahem. Hey, you made it. Woo! I was beginning to wonder if you were going to show. The party's in full swing. Come on in. You have to try this Teresian ale. It's fantastic. We should have conquered this planet ages ago. Careful, Sana. That wine's got quite the kick. A couple more bottles and we'll be passed out on the floor. Who cares? We're not on duty tomorrow. Let's live a little. Come on, drink up. Yeah, live a little. I mean, I don't, I don't really drink, but... Uh, wait a minute. Hello? Oh my god, did somebody poison their drinks? Holy crap! The Sith at the party underestimated the infamous kick of Teresian Ale? Oh my god, is that crap really that strong? That's like the frickin' moonshine of Star Wars, man. Holy god. Well, Karth, uh, this is the perfect time <laughs> to check their bags for uniforms, Karth. What did you think I was gonna say, you frickin' weirdo? Come on now. Sith armor! It worked! Oh, shit. Is this... Oh my god, it fits me! It fits me, Garth! I'm a Sith! I can't believe this. I'm a frickin' Sith, guys. What's in here? Ooh, parts, computer spikes. Nice, nice, nice. But we don't have a uniform for Karth. Where are we gonna find a uniform for him? Yeah, I got no idea what... Oh, shit, there's a Sith trooper over there. When the hell did he get there, Karth? We can't risk the Sith finding out that we stole one of their uniforms, so we better take it off real quick. What? Oh, jeez. I don't know if we should go over there, Karth. What do you think? I mean, there's no more uniforms in here. This might be our only shot at getting Karth a uniform, too. Mmm. I'm gonna go check it out. Stay right behind me, Karth. We better get our weapons out. Just move along. There's nothing to see here. Where did you hide those Sith uniforms? Did you sell them to the Teresian underground? Start talking. I want answers. Yeah, please. I'm only a visitor to Terrace, trapped here by your quarantines. 
I know nothing about the Tarishian underground or your missing Sith uniforms. Oh damn, they're talking about uniforms, I knew it. So, uh, what's going on in there, Mr. Sith, hmm? You're a little too curious for your own good, civilian. This doesn't concern you. I know all about Sith interrogations. This isn't going to end well. I'm getting sick of your lies, you alien scum. We've got your ugly mug and a security tape from the base. Start talking before I splatter your slimy brains all over this room. Uh -huh. Jesus! I think the commander's losing his temper. I'm glad I'm out of here. It took me an hour to clean the bloodstains from my uniform after the last interrogation. Good lord, man! Oh my god! Garth, we better get the hell out of here. I mean, Jesus. But no, we gotta get those uniforms. Maybe the alien, uh, doesn't know anything, you know? Just stay out of this if you know what's good for you. Damn it, we need this alien alive we're gonna find out how to get Karth's uniforms. I won't let you kill this defenseless prisoner, you Sith scum. What was that? Did I hear you right? Let us kill him? How can you stop us? Time to teach this civilian the penalty for defying the Sith. <laughs> oh shit, more light side points. Well, alrighty then. Oh shit, he's got a sword. Ah, he's got a knife! Karth, get your blaster ready. I'm gonna power blast him. <laughs> Oh, you're gonna get it, bud. Hold up. Karth, I think I got this one, Karth. I think I got him. <laughs> Let's get it. Get him, Karth. Nice shooting, Karth. What did the chair do to you, Karth? What did that poor chair ever do to you? <laughs> Wait, what? Hold on. What is the Sith commander picking up right now? I'm so confused. All right. Yeah. <laughs> You're gonna be picking up your brains off the floor in a second, bud. There we go. There's another one? Hey, buddy. Oh. Thank you, Hubert. The Sith would have killed me. Of that I am certain. I don't know who you are, but it is clear you are no friend of the Sith. Among my people, there is a saying. The enemy of my enemy is my friend. Like you, I hate the Sith. That's why I stole those Sith uniforms for the Hidden Backs! The Hidden Backs? Aren't they one of the swoop gangs down there in the Lower City? Oh, I guess the Sith was right, you're a spy after all, holy crap. In the Lower City there are some who do not bow to the Conquerors. Swoop gangs like the Hidden Backs are gathering resources to one day strike against the Sith oppressors. If you wish to strike another blow against the Sith, you would be wise to journey to the Lower City and speak with Gadon Thak, the leader of the Hidden Backs. Gadon Thak? Really? What exactly are these Hidden Backs planning? You would have to ask Gadon Thak to know the answer to that question. They approached me, and my only role was to obtain the Sith uniforms for them. So basically this gang is planning on striking against the Sith. Don't know how successful they'll be, but... So can I get one of those uniforms from you? You know, I, I did kind of just save your life right there. I am sorry, but all the uniforms I had were given to the Hidden Backs. I suppose you could take the uniforms from the bodies of the Sith soldiers in the room if you want them. Yeah, that is very true. We could just loot the bodies that we just killed. I'll be going now. You get your alien ass out of here before the Sith show up again. Ashra, the Sith know my face now. I must find somewhere to hide on this world. Thank you once again, human. Check it out, Karth. I think this one's your size, my dude. Karth? Let's fucking get it, dude. We're a couple of Sith. <laughs> Ooh, got even more stuff on this guy. A blaster rifle and everything. I like it. Okay, not bad. Not bad. How about in this footlocker? We got some med packs, computer spikes, credits. Very good. All right, we got a couple of Sith suits, Karth. I think pretty soon we're going to be ready for that lower city. But take that uniform off for now, Karth. We don't want to draw too much attention to ourselves. I think one uniform is going to be enough while walking around. Hey, kid! Now the kid's gonna think I'm one of the Sith. Hey, 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 kid, uh, what, what's up, buddy? You're one of them Sith, ain't you? Yep. My mommy says I'm not supposed to talk to you. Oh, yeah, well, the Emperor of the Galaxy says that you have to talk to me or there's gonna be problems. You're one of them Sith, ain't you? Ah, forget it. You know, there might be some interesting hijinks we can pull off wearing this uniform, guys. <laughs> I'm kinda into it. <clears throat> Hello there, woman. How are you? 
I I'm sorry. I don't want to get in the way of official Sith business. This is ridiculous. I wonder how many people we can fool with this. More parts and med packs and credits? There's an easy score around this place. Hey, buddy! Please, don't take me for questioning. <laughs> I, I don't know anything, I swear! Oh, this is great, man. I'm just fooling everybody into thinking I'm a Sith. Okay, you know what, Karth? I think it's time we bust open a few doors. <laughs> Ready? Go for it, Karth! On it. It's open. What? Hello! Who are you? Who are you? And who are you? You're... You're with the Sith, ain't you? Uh-huh. Oh, sure. I recognize the uniform. What do you want? I haven't done anything wrong. If you want to search the place, go ahead. I won't stop you. I've got nothing to hide from you. <laughs> okay, Mr. Largo. I will. Hmm. Medpack parts, credits. Nice, nice. But a little low. You make sure you have a better haul next time, Mr. Largo. Let's see what else is around here, Karth. Oh, yeah, we got that one other door over here. Bust it open, Karth. Ready. It's open. Nice. Yes? Uh-oh. Ahem, <clears throat> excuse me, excuse me. I'm with the Sith. I I'm sorry. I don't want to get in the way of official Sith business. Mm-hmm. You're one of them Sith, ain't you? Yeah, what? My mommy says I'm not supposed to talk to you. Oh my god, guys. They made the voices for the kids sound so unisex that they could just put it to a boy or a girl. Oh, that's a little bit lazy. <laughs> Same thing as usual. Parts, med pack, credits. Thank you, thank you. And remember, don't get in the way of official Sith business or there will be problems. Please, don't take me for questioning. Oh my I god. don't know anything. I swear. They all say the same things. You know where it would be really fun to do this, guys? Back at the frickin' cantina. I'll see you there in a second, Box Bros. Hey, hey there, droid. Greetings and good day. I hope your patrolling goes well today. All hail the Sith. What? Oh my god. He said, the fucking droid said, see Kyle, dude. <laughs> he's, he's all down with the Sith, boys. I told you them droids, they, they like it. Hey, buddy. Hey, what do you think you're doing? You can't go into the cantina while you're on duty. What? But I'm off duty. Then you shouldn't be in full uniform. If you're off duty, go change your outfit. If not, get back to your patrol room. What, you mean I can't go into the cantina looking like this? Oh man, what a jip, Karth! Yes, what's on your mind? Oh, You got it. No, I don't got it, man. I'm pissed. That sucks. Okay, what about Keble Yurt? I bet you we can mess with her a little bit. <clears throat> yes, Miss Yurt, we are back. Uh, and we've come for more robots and things. You, you better hand it over. Oh, hello there. What can I do for you? Would you like to see my inventory? That is why you're here, isn't it? At least, I hope so. Yo, what if she gives us better deals or or something because we're the, in the Sith uniform? No, no, everything's still expensive as hell. Oh, well. Thanks anyway, Keble. Oh, I know what we could do. We could go into the apartments over here. Maybe we can mess with Lorem a little bit. Yeah, let's see what Lorem's got to say. And Kadir, oh man, this is gonna be great. Mm -mm, I heard you were selling to illegal aliens. And you're in big trouble there, Lorem. Takum justak miki grabulbogo. Kachichu ita bodunga. Tulbabank waleo ganda nalu chuchut. Oh yeah, well, well, trouble just found you, Lorem. Prepare your asshole, Lorem. Prepare it real good, cause I'm gonna blast a hole right in that green bitch stomach of yours. Oh, don't you turn your back on me! Don't you turn your back on me, Lorem! I s you know what? Lorem's no fun. I'm gonna go talk to Kadir. Maybe threatening him will be funnier. Hey, Kadir! Don't, 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 don't hurt me. I'm just the janitor here. <laughs> I don't know nothing that would be useful to you, Sith. No, you're done, Kadir. You're done. Oh, hey, 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 get back over here, Kadir. Hey, hey, you're done. You're done, Kadir. You, you've cleaned your last, your last. Oh, this is kind of boring, guys. I gotta, I gotta tell you, <laughs> this isn't as fun as I thought it would be. Uh, there's a few more people we might be able to mess with, but screw it, I'm bored of it. So. I guess that's gonna do it for this episode, Box Bros. Thanks so much for watching. We got some Sith uniforms, and now I guess we're gonna be ready to head into the lower city. Oh boy, so we'll be doing that in the next one. But as always, thanks so much for watching, guys. This has been Ragebox. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, as always, for more outstanding Let's Plays. And until next time, me and Karth will catch you later. Peace out, guys.